We continue to track local breaking news tonight. One person is dead, another in the hospital. This after a crash involving a semi and a motorcycle in western Douglas County. Our Don Grenice has been digging into uh, details at the scene. He's near 264th in Center. Don, what do you know so far? John and Mallory, this roadway has just been able to open up. They've just cleared up the scene within the past 30 minutes or so. We do know again one person has died, another seriously injured. The crash was witnessed by some of the people who work at this gas station and they actually ran out to help after they witnessed this crash. And the shop just happens to be owned by Waterloo Fire Chief Travis Harlow, who believes there should maybe be a stoplight at the intersection because this isn't the first time this has happened. In fact, there have been others here just this year. When asked about this before, the Department of Roads explained they believe a stoplight could contribute to even more crashes. And while they've yet to release any details as to how the crash happened, the Douglas County Sheriff's Office tells it this, that it uh, involved two people on a motorcycle and a driver of a semi truck. So a medical helicopter took the surviving injured biker from this scene. They're still continuing to gather more, talking to witnesses. They said at first there were even some conflicting reports out here. Now we see the stoplight behind us here that you just saw. There is at least telling people to yield when they're going through this intersection and for the people entering this busy road to stop. Obviously a dangerous intersection out here. Uh, we should be learning more about this exact investigation further details tomorrow and later this week. John right. and Mallory. All right. Thank you, Don Grenier, reporting live. Well,